Good evening, Alexis Govea reporting at La Monica Stadium where the Golden Eagles will host the Central Grizzlies. Both teams are headed into tonight's game 3-0 in track and 7-1 overall. This is championship football, guys. It does not get any bigger than this. Let's get started. Track showdown as Central's Trey Walker is getting down. Bloody Dark Roads. Coach Big said tonight they have the chance to make history. Change the game. Yeah. Got it. Every oh. single play. The Grizzlies force the Eagles to punt on their first possession. Javon Bigelow converts on fourth down and gets the Grizzlies in the red zone. That would set up Deatri Brewer for the 30-yard touchdown. Keeper, he would have a big game tonight. Central's defense also had a big game. Clovis West, Dante Shashere hits his target, but that target is going nowhere. Forced a punt, then first and 10, Deatri Brewer squeezes in and takes this all the way for a 30-yard touchdown run. That makes it 13 zip, Grizzlies on top. The Eagles trying to respond on third down, but that's just before Justin Henry takes down Dante for a huge loss. The Eagles would punt. The Grizzlies trying to capitalize on good field position after the punt. Trent, he freaked them with the okie doke got the first out of bounds at the 30-yard line. Then on first and 10 on their own 14, Trent airs out a beauty to Manuel Davis for the touchdown. <laughs> Moving on to the second half. High snap, but Trent is able to get this off to Jacob Torres. We want to tell you just how fast this guy is. As he's outrunning the defenders, he loses his shoe at midfield and shows he can still get the job done, shoeless or not, as he takes it to the house for an 80-yard touchdown reception. That was the first play in the second half. Grizzlies pouring it on the Eagles. We'll give you your shoe back, kid. On third and 10 on their own 15, Dante trying to convert. This defense was a team effort as Trey and Trevor team up for the sack. That's a 10-yard loss for the Eagles, forcing them to punt again. Central continuing to secure the bag with Trent connecting to his favorite target, Jacob Torres, for a 50-yard reception. Bringing the Grizzlies to the second yard line. There's no stop in this force. Deatri Brewer with his third touchdown for the Grizzlies. This is looking like the new norm as the Grizzlies separate themselves in the books. Both teams going in with the same record. How does it feel to get the win tonight? I mean, we just made history today. You know, Central has never won two track championships, so it just feels good to go and make history today. I'm just proud of my team today. We came out and did what we were supposed to do. You know, we held them the whole game mostly. We just did what we had to do, came out here and played our hearts out. Next week is the last game of the final season. What do you got to do to keep this momentum going? I mean, day in and day out, just do what we're supposed to do. Practice hard, finish our assignments, anything like that. Just finish. All we got to do is just finish. I mean, I, I, I'm going both ways now from not starting running back, so it just feels good to go in there and do something that I was doing last year. You know, I, I still love running back, so it just felt good to go in there and do that. Deontre Brewer finished the game with 60 yards on the ground with three touchdowns and two sacks as Central dominated the entire game. They had the Eagles shut out until the fourth quarter. Next week is senior night for the Grizzlies as they take on Clovis East at home. Reporting from the Monica Stadium, I'm Alexis Govea.